Hey, what is going on guys? Welcome back to another tutorial. In this one, I'm showing you the absolute best way, or it might be one of the best ways to cut stuff out in Photopea. And I've made a video like this before, but I was not using the best way. I showed how to cut stuff out with the lasso tool, which actually isn't the best idea because it can't do round corners very well. So this is gonna be the best way to do that. And also how to outline objects with like a glow or different things like that. So let's get started. So the first thing you want to do is have your picture and I want to crop out the sniper rifle and his hands. So that's going to be super easy. I'm just going to zoom in at one of the corners where it starts. So down here, go over here to your pen tool. And then what you want to do, it kind of works like the lasso tool. So you just want to click at each point. And you can see there's a little bit of a curve here. So I'll show you how to deal with that. So, so right here, you just hold left click and then drag your mouse right and then it will start to push that curve back, as you can see. So it's a lot better than the lasso tool. It might be kind of weird at first, but you'll get the hang of it. So I'm getting there and uh, I'm gonna keep speeding it up. Okay, so once you connect back to the start, it will outline your object. Make sure you're on your background layer when you see this outline, because if you don't see this outline on the background layer, it's not gonna cut it out properly. So it's on the background layer, it's selected. Go up to make selection. I just changed mine to intersect, but I don't really think that matters. Um, hit okay, and it will outline it like this. And now all you have to do is hit control C and control V. And if you hide those other layers, you will see that we have the gun here now by itself, but there's still part of the background right here. So all you got to do is get your pin tool, just select all the parts you don't want. Connect back to the start, right click, make a selection and then just hit delete. And when you want to get rid of the outline right here and it keeps connecting, just hit delete on your keyboard. Jeez, that's awful. Okay, make selection. Okay, delete. There you go. It's crappy, but there you go. That's how you do it. And now if you just want to add effects to it, all you got to do is just double click on that layer. Click stroke or uh, outer glow. There's a drop shadow. You can really just start adding all of your effects now since you have it separated from the background. And you could even bring the background back and still have this outline. So you can see... I just got to move it back to where it was. See, there you go. That's how you do it. So hopefully it helps you guys. If it did, leave a like and subscribe as always.